Hello and welcome back to the Helmet Head YouTube channel. Now, if you're like me and own a DJI Action 3 or 4, then a brand called Telesyn makes a must-have accessories. Not just that, the ultimate accessory to improve all of your footage. And they've sent me all three to give them the 11 out of 10 review, including an unboxing and real well test. So let's check them out. <laughs> Let's start with the Telesing Camera Storage Protective Bag. This has a nice quality feel into it with a leather hard case outside and in a nice soft middle. What's well, got a protective layer so it won't scratch the lens of your camera. Next is the Telesin Magnetic Two Claw Adapter. This has a real heavy duty premium feel to it, knowing that your camera is always gonna be safe using this adapter. And then finally, the ultimate accessory, the Telesin ND filter set, including CPL plus ND8, ND16 and ND32. These have a real premium quality feel and they're a simple push over your original lens for easy installation. Let's start with one of the most used piece of kit that we have to use on a constant basis with our DJI Action 3 or 4 camera and that is this two claw magnetic adapter. Now when you buy your Osmo what you end up getting is one of these with it and if you've gone even further and bought the combo pack you'll get two but they're never enough because the idea is you can quite simply click your camera on and then to remove it you can unclip it just as easy but if you've only got one of these that come with the camera then you're missing out on multiple different shots that you can use by having multiple of these connected to everything you need. Right from the selfie stick, obviously to your motorcycle helmet or whatever sports equipment or vehicle you're using. Now Telesyn sell these at a fraction of the price of DJI's and in my opinion, they are better than theirs with this nice, good, thick piece of rubber to stop any kind of slide whatsoever and even stronger look oh, feeling of getting it connected in place i like that i like that also with the adapter you get a nice thumb screw as well what's got some nice rivets in it that makes it super easy to attach you simply slide it into place and as you can see with the nice heavy duty thumb screw it can tighten up lovely so you've not got any movement. Next up for the must have accessory. Now, have you ever thought about storing your camera? Because if you're like me, you could use a smelly sock, but the problem with using that smelly sock on your camera is that it doesn't really protect the lens very well and you'll get loads of little micro scratches on it. What well, means you have to go for the expense of paying for a new lens. But the thing of it is, Telesyn have made their own storage bag. Now this storage bag, as you can see, even has the little lip for the camera. Inside, it has a beautiful protective layer to it. That means you're not gonna scratch it. But best of all, just popping it into the case, closing it and zipping it up, you can still keep the feet part of your magnetic connector adapter on it. What means that you can literally have it on your selfie stick with the cover on, so it's always ready just to whip off and use. That is absolutely brilliant for a fantastic price. Now, the absolute game changer of accessories, because Telesyn sell a set of ND filters. And the thing about this, the thing that's gonna make this camera so much better is these filters make such a difference to this camera. Now, if you're like me, and I use it facing me a lot, as soon as it's not got the perfect light, it literally blackens me out. It's awful and it completely destroys the shot. But what these do, it's almost like putting a pair of sunglasses over the lens. So it's not got all that light coming into it. What means that you will no longer be blacked out and rubbish and blurry ever again that will make these set of filters a game changer for your action three or four. Let's put them to the test. Now you have different strength of ND filters in the box. You get four of them in total, CPL, 
ND8, ND16 and ND32. So let's go through each one and see what the quality difference is like. So let's start with the standard CPL lens. Now this stands for circular polarizer and ND stands for neutral density. Now to install your lenses, it could not get easy. See the little mark there? This little mark goes on the top. But what you do is you pop this on just like this with a nice firm push and it'll be in place. Also, don't forget to remove that screen cover. Now with the CPL lens on, let's have a look at the footage between this and the standard lens that you get on the camera. So this is now just the standard lens on a sweeping shot. And if we now face this towards me in direct sunlight, and now we spin it round, so I'm out of direct sunlight, you'll see me darkening off as you can see. That is just the standard lens. Now let's pop this on and see the difference. Now with the CPL lens on, this is the sweeping shot as we come across. And now if we turn the camera around onto me again, directly into the sunlight, and we spin the camera around with the sun behind me, I will get darker, but you should see me that little bit more clearly already you can spot the difference. Let's move on to the next filter. So again, the same shot with the standard lens sweeping round, and then changing the camera to me. What you now get is the sun directly facing me, and as I spin it round, you will get the sun behind me darkening my face yet again, and moving it back round into the sunlight. So let's pop on the ND8 filter. Now the same shot with the ND filter in position, sweeping round the countryside and then spinning the camera around to me. Direct sunlight shining straight into my face now as we spin the camera around, moving the sun behind me. This is a very powerful sunlight and as you can see, I'm darkening off there. But if we bring it even closer, even less and less for the amount of sunlight that there is today and then bring the shot back round into the sunshine. We're now gonna move on to ND16. The standard shot on the standard lens, again, sweeping round, looking at the beautiful countryside, spinning it round so it's on me, direct sunlight in my face again, and then spinning it round, of course, to give you that darker shot and continue going round for the sunlight to pick up and hit me again. Time for the next filter. Now with the ND16 filter in place with this sweeping beautiful shot and then we're now going to turn it on to me with direct sunlight again and we're going to slowly move it around to have the sun at the back of my head. As we do you'll start seeing me go darker again but even less so and then we're going to be moving it around again into direct sunlight. That is the ND16. Let's move on to the ND32. So the final sweep on the standard lens again. So you can see what the difference is between the filter. We're gonna now swap it onto me, direct sunlight again on my face as we spin it round to sunlight behind me. And then we'll keep going so you can see that the light coming back onto my face with the standard lens. Let's pop the filter on. Now with the ND32 filter on with the nice sweep around, and then I'm gonna move it to my face for the direct sunlight shot. As we continue sweeping around to have the sun behind me, and then you should start to see my face darken again. And then we're slowly gonna move around and move on to the sun shining inside my face. Now I'm sure you'll agree with me that Telesyn have smashed it out the park yet again. And the thing of it is, these ND filters make such a difference. Now I was generally thinking about getting rid of my DJI action camera because real bugbear is losing those shots when it's such beautiful sunlight and I'm getting all darkened out and the shot is spoiled. But with these ND filters, I no longer have to. So I'm gonna be hanging on to my camera for that much longer. Now for me here in the UK, I will probably run ND8 filter majority of the time. And then when I'm abroad, when the sunlight's that little bit stronger, I'll be looking at using my ND16 and 32. But it's just for me, save this camera. Plus having that awesome carry case, that means that I no longer scratch lenses. I can pop it into my luggage when I'm going away or into my bag when I'm out and about, protecting the lenses on this camera 
is just so much better. And of course, having that fantastic magnetic adapter, I need to buy a few more of them because they're just so handy. Because when you're doing those action shots and you're swapping from your motorcycle to your helmet, to your selfie stick and all over the place, more is better. And at that price, that price, it's a no brainer to pick up at least two or three more. So if you've enjoyed any of these products, all the links and everything you need to know to pick up yours are down in the description. Pop down there and just click on it. You'll be surprised at the prices and the quality that you get from Telesyn. Now, if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget if there's somebody else that could benefit from any of these accessories or all of these accessories, please share this video with them. And don't forget to hit that subscribe so you don't miss anything here in the tech space. And I'll see you in the next Helmet Head video. Take care for now. Bye-bye. <laughs>